Okay, so I've been getting asked about mouse toggle, how to get it, how to do all that stuff. So I actually did a video just recently um, on like how to do the secret codes and how to get certain things. So I'm going to show you guys how to get a mouse toggle app for your Fire Stick um, or Fire Cube, Fire TV, whatever you guys have. So if you guys are brand new to the channel, please consider subscribing. If you guys are brand new to the channel, if you guys are returning subscribers, welcome back. So here we go. Okay, we're gonna come here to my Fire TV, and we're gonna come here to find. Um, and actually, not find. We already have Downloader. So if you guys don't have Downloader, um, you guys need to get it. You guys need to get it. I've done plenty of videos of how to get this app and how to turn on developer options and stuff like that. So make sure you guys do both of those things. So here we go. We're going to go to downloader. Um, we're going to come here and put this code in. Now this is from Troy point. Um, if you guys are not familiar with his stuff, um, you know, but stuff like downloader, it's a really good one. I, I kind of wish he had like a little shortcut for this stuff here, but I understand why they don't. So the password or the code is two, five, zero, nine, three, one two five zero nine three one and once you put it in hit okay it's going to redirect you just give it a few seconds and it's going to redirect you now the one thing i really do like about this stuff is is he's got like um downloader app codes he's got like like tons of stuff here that you could use so i'm just going to scroll down and there's not that much stuff here to like it's just a bunch of apps so it's got like tons of apps that you can use tv mate stuff like that um side launcher all that stuff which is great so what we're looking for is that mouse toggle so it does take a minute because there is a lot of stuff in here so you kind of have to take like take your time so here we go the top one says uh mouse fire stick mouse toggle 1.12 if this doesn't work uninstall it and get the one right below it which is mouse toggle 1.06 so we got the previous version and the latest version so we're going to hit download and it's going to do this thing now once you're done you want to click down it's kind of really hard to see on the bottom right hand corner but click down 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 and then click to the right once and then click enter and it should be install now once you do click down again and then hit done and then you want to delete this you don't want this thing here because it's just taking up space and you don't want that once you're done um here's one tip that a lot of people don't know about um, that they don't maybe they don't talk about it so what i do is i take my mouse come up here to the top um and it is going to take me all the way to the top and come here to this little with the three lines the hamburger button and click add current page to favorites and then hit save what this does is anytime you need this page again this is where it's going to be so we're going to come over here back to my apps this is where all your apps is this little box click on this come down and there it is mouse toggle for your fire stick now um you're going to get this little pop-up says Al allow usb debugging so the first thing is don't hit okay make sure that little box where it says always allow from this computer is clicked on check mark and then hit okay once you're done bottom left hand corner see what says status um, it's going to say starting. It might be blank. You want to wait until it says started. Um, right now it's just doing its thing. Just leave it alone. Give it a few seconds. It shouldn't take that long. Now, if it is taking a while here where it just says starting, starting, you'll see where I'm like moving my, my clicker up and down. It's right now it says enable the mouse service and then auto start the mouse. If it says, if it gets stuck on starting, Right here, go to ADB settings. It says tip, switch the ADB debugging setting off and then on if the status below is stuck on starting. So make sure you come down here to that ADB settings, click on this, and then if it doesn't work where it's just stuck on starting and it's not working and you're clicking it and it's not doing anything, come here to your home button. So as you can see, I'm clicking it, it's not working. Click on the home button and you want to go all the way to that settings thing go over here to my fire tv go over to developer options adb debugging turn it off give it a minute turn it on um, you want to check this install for unknown sources i would turn this on um, just in case and then back up and then go back here to your apps and then just come all the way down here to your mouse toggle again 
and it should say starting so what i'm just going to hit the back button get out and get back in so i've noticed sometimes it will fix it if it just says starting and it doesn't do anything um so now the 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 thing here is the way this thing works is if you double click the pause play button the mouse is going to pop up so there you go um as you can see it, it's a pretty flimsy one so if you're like if you hold it then it's gonna it's gonna be squirrely it's gonna be very very squirrely um now the other thing is sometimes there's pages so what you want to do is that forward button if you hit that it's going to scroll down if you hit that little settings button here at the top it's going to scroll up and then to exit just hit the back button once and then you should be good to go the mouse is still going to be there but as you can see here like I'm, I'm moving it up and down and it's not doing anything and then if i double click that pause play button again there it is it pops right back up so um that's how it works pretty simple sometimes again it gets it, it just gets stuck on the starting page but it will work and yeah you should be good to go with that one so it's pretty good let me know what you guys think i try to get you guys here some of the latest stuff want to be sure the video is not too long for you guys um hopefully it wasn't so leave me a comment below let me know if you guys have ever played with that app before so yeah with all that being said you guys take care take care of each other see you guys in the next one